we move on to anything else, let me go ahead and trade over the 1.6 trim I borrowed from my boy Gobo over here because uh, otherwise it will you all will start complaining. <laughs> Just get that over and done with real quick. Um, so that is out of the way. It's already Tuesday at this point, so ugh, quite a few days have passed. Just finding it rough to find time to like fully commit. And last night I did a bit of hunt left, but then I also realized, oh, I'm on a 26 kill streak. Luckily, we didn't end up dying or anything, but just a sudden realization that I should probably just focus on finishing that off first. There is an edge hotspot right now. They will do a bit more PKing until we either die or get the 50. Let's go ahead and check our weekly task. And Enchanted Yoshi for our elite is always a wonderful thing to see. Dragon Hunter Lance Eye. Larence Keys and Armadillo Chest Plates. That is honestly a really good start. Honestly, we're kind of broke, but an enchanted yo Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> hey, over two trill. This thing went up, didn't it? Yeah, damn. What happened to the Yoshi price? Why, why did it shoot up all of a sudden? Last time we bought any, it was like 1.6. We just try and enchant one. Oh, that could take. That could go so wrong, but it could also go so well. We are already a little bit dry on it, and I remember at the start it went just so good. Let's try a couple and see if we can get lucky. Oh, it's gonna easily go over the price that we uh, <laughs> that we will pay for an enchanted Yoshi. I'm so oh I'm stupid sometimes. I'm not gonna lie. Let's try ten attempts. That's already on the expensive side. Does the Yoshi not need to be unnoted compared to the other ones? Yeah. Okay. And then Blood Diamonds. Do we have any of those? Not too many. Oh, fuck's sake. I can't type, bro. 10 Yoshis. And then I need 50 Diamonds. Let's grab a couple more. We can always make a bit more money soon, TM, of course. Just focus on other shit. But uh, yeah, I'm going to start playing a bit more dedicatedly and same with uh, the PKing part just kind of want to get it done and over with and not show too much of it to you guys um, and just kind of go through it quickly you know just get the fights done and over with and just show the kill uh, moments cat of course I had a I had a hunch this might happen I had a feeling oh lordy lord let's do a uh, six more god why am I why am I like this bro <laughs> Oh, this is what happens when you don't gamble in the actual gamble area. You start searching for it everywhere else where you can. Son of a... Give me my diamonds, please. Be quick. Okay, six more. We're really hoping we would get it very quickly, I'm not gonna lie. Ouch, 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 ouch. Why are you like this? Yoshi, you were so good to me at the start. What happened? You're turning turning into a doppelganger at this point. I shouldn't uh, get rid of my entire cash tag, honestly. Let's just stop doing attempts for now. This will be uh, the first step for this week. God, I feel like every time I make a bit of money, I'm throwing it right back at the Wanderer and losing it. Which is uh, unfortunate, but also an important part of our progress, I suppose. Just not in the uh, weekly weekly task, or like weekly? <laughs> in the seasonal task department, but progress is progress. I just want to get my hard ones out of the way, because that will um, decide whether or not we'll run into something completely, you know, blocking us. You know, like a, like a fucking Wicked Blade or some shit as a hard step. Ooh, Siren Tone? I don't think that's cheap. Ugh. Too trill. Yeah, we are definitely a little itty bitty broke. I shouldn't have done those Yoshis. I'm, oh, I'm so stubborn. Um, but fine. Let's go ahead and do a bit of PKing. I know it gets a bit repetitive. My apologies if you're one of the people that just absolutely cannot stand the PK clips. I saw, I'm sorry, but it, to be fair, it is spawn PK. So PKing is going to be a crucial part of this server, no matter how you look at it. Uh, I also couldn't help but notice, although we're going for a kill streak, I'm super low on cursed orbs. What's up with that? I only have one. Uh, we have a decent amount of the other ones. Let's just try and get a couple more at least. Miscellaneous, cursed orb. One. Fail. Fail. Two. Eh. Out of five is not bad. 
have a couple in the bank. But yeah, um, like I said, we're gonna run through this very quickly. If at least for now, the wonder tasks are looking doable, completable. So it should be another week for 7.5k tokens. As long as we can make the money for it. But if I just start playing a bit more seriously, that should be doable. Haven't even done my servers the last few days. I should definitely do that in a little bit as well. Because it's free fucking money. Uh, what am I looking for? I don't know. Yeah, went for a double spec at five man. Just kind of had to went had to go for it there. Mr. Benji over here, good look at look. Oh, damn! I played that pretty poorly, didn't I? Well, there goes the kill streak. Whoopsie. That <laughs> was so anticlimactic after all the talking about it we did. And then I lose it two kills in. Oh well. Well then with that out of the way, we can focus on other shit again. Honestly, PKing is fun, but I don't like PKing with the curse thing all that much. It's OP and it's satisfying, but it's repetitive and easy and simple. And I don't feel like there's anything too exciting going on for the majority of it. There's one other thing I am looking forward to, because I remember they made some changes to... Uh, what's it called? Dragon Ore Armor? Like the Dragon Ornament Armor thingy? <laughs> Dragon G? <laughs> what the fuck is it called? Let me look. Uh, Y'all know what the fuck I mean though, right? Like the Dragon G Armor. Yeah, this shit. Increases damage of Dragon Weaponry by 15% when the full set is worn. So, that's what it already did before, but in a recent update, I believe they added accuracy to it, if I'm not mistaken. Right, so I got the update post right here. Uh, Dragon G armor has been buffed. Side effect now grants 15% accuracy, and the helmet plate body and legs now have more strength bonus matching a magma helm, Festa plate body, and Festa plate legs. Which should have been a Festa skirt, come on, Ryan. But uh, <laughs> that point aside, I think that should make it quite a bit better with Dragon armor, so I've been wanting to test that a bit. Just didn't want to do it on the kill streak. Um, and I realized I'm 500 thousand ish cursed bounty hunter points off from buying a second one of these we need the money right now so i'm just buying one straight away uh this one is 5500 so we'll put it in for that and then if we can get a few more bh points later that would be nice then we can also get the other one the glorious casket sadly is not selling for two trill how much are people putting it in for now already much cheaper oh shaking my head we'll put it in for 19 as well 1.9 um, hopefully that can sell soon. Same with the tectonic play body. Those items have crashed quite a bit. But yeah, I think game with the Dragon G uh, armor could be fun. Could be a nice change of pace. Uh, they also made a lot of other quality of life changes like the rates daily. If you do Grandmaster rates, it now counts as two towards your daily. Stuff like that is pretty cool. But obviously we are very far off from that. Um, so yeah. I think that about covers what I wanted to cover. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do a bit more hunt left. We have the gear for it, so why the fuck not? Worst case, I can eventually just sell off my Cursed Fang if we really need some more money and it will last us a good while. But I think I need to stop making stupid decisions like enchanting Yoshis that don't get enchanted. Uh, and focus a bit more on saving up money. I don't think inherently doing the wonder is a bad decision because obviously we're gonna profit off of that in the long run but just the way i go about it should be a bit better and i want to start saving up money for real now so we can actually like uh get the important things like our our seasonal goals and all of that stuff so yeah let's start off with some collection log hunting and go back to hunt left it's so anticlimactic, but I didn't think I would die two fights in, I'm not gonna lie, I got a little overconfident. Oh well. First PK we are seeing here. See what we can uh, attempt to do here, fight back a little bit at least. Did he already leave? Okay. Wasn't that much of a tank test that way. Uh, someone else got on him, I didn't realize that. That makes sense. 
Interrupting my hunt left grinds for a little night there, you never know. Surely one day I'll actually get something, just not today. Multiple nightmare staff, some people getting some nice stuff and a harmonized orb. But nothing for me. Not like these kind of people risk anything, but we'll take the free PK, I suppose. Oh, 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 it finally happened. There it is. Unlift collection log. We finally got the epic. Well, I say finally. We got the epic pet box. 1389 KC. It's only finally because I took my sweet ass time hunting it. But uh, 1389 for the log is honestly kind of on the spoonish side compared to most people. So, uh,. Yeah, wow, that came out of nowhere. I saw the collection log pop and I was like, hey, that can only be one thing. Wow, that is, uh, that's pretty sick. Didn't think we would uh, get it so soon. I'm 1.8K dry on pet box and crate. You see what I mean? Like, it's not the worst. Before I even open that thing, I want to see in here. What do we get for that? A cursed bounty chest. So that's like an additional 500 billish reward. Nothing too insane, but still a nice little bonusy, right? Um, that should sell for a decent amount. Obviously the drop itself isn't anything too crazy, but now we can finally kind of move on from it. 700 bill, does it ever even sell for that? I need to be more specific, don't I? Hold up, hold up. Recently sold for 700 bill, yeah, okay, fuck it then. Let's put it in for that, see if it sells. And I think we can finally move on to actually doing Nightmare now. I've, I enjoy Hunt Left though, don't get me wrong. Hunt Left has been very lucrative for us. I think I'm even missing one of the pets on my collection log that doubled. But uh, five both of us, that alone is like five trillion. I mean, I didn't sell every one of them for five for a trill each, but we have made a fair share of money here, to say the very least. <laughs> so I like this place. I might even come back just for the drops at some point, but we got the log, an additional 10 points. We are still very far away from completing our seasonal goal, if I'm not mistaken. We're at 40 points at the moment. We have the fusion gloves and the icon. We have this icon for 50, this for 125, so that's 175, that's 215. So I would need another 85 collection log points to finish this season. Still quite a bit to go, but if we get 10 more points, we can increase from this one to this one, because then I would have 100 points to get that which would be a nice little bonus, why not, right? More damage over more accuracy. And then uh, at some point, once we get the Wanderer's Icon, and this is also a reason I'm finally interested in getting them, we can get the Blessings instead of the Icon, and then we can combine both of them, have both of them in use at the same time, which is wonderful. So, yeah. Anticlimactic, but we finished it. <laughs> I don't know what else to say about that one. Let's move on to Nightmare and see if we can finally start getting some drops there, because up until now, I haven't done that much. Uh, well, eh, 738, I, I would say that's a decent amount of KC, but absolutely nothing so far. But to be fair, I didn't want to do it too much until we got a Fortune Genie anyway, because now we can actually double those relatively expensive drops. Nightmare can be very lucrative. We just need to start seeing some actual Inquisitor drops. Ah, they're not cheap though. Only a trill a drop. I thought it was more than that, honestly. The maze would be expensive too, Trill, let alone if you doubled that bad boy. Maybe one of the orbs, like Harmonized Orb, Eldritch Orb, 900 billish. Don't see any volatile ones, but I doubt it's much more expensive than that. Yeah. Yeah, the Siren Tome, I guess, for which is going for around 2 Trill. I guess that and the Inquisitor Maze are the drops you really hope for. But honestly, anything collection log related would be nice and we'll see more Night Terrors and all of that along the way. So, well, let's get started. Didn't think I would finish Hunt Love that, that early though. I still got 10 minutes on my boost and that was the first hour. 